Hi, hello, how are you today? Today we are going to start about another question for passing in the MRCS exam based on EMRCS. We will discuss all the question of EMRCS for passing MRCS and we will also discuss about the recalls, about the FOSIA sheets and other question which is related to the MRCS exam. And we will also discuss the topics of MRCS. So stay tuned with us and crack the MRCS. So here the question, the question is, you are assisting in an open right adrenectomy for a large adrenal adenoma. The consultant is distracted and you helpfully pull the adrenal into the wound to improve the view. Unfortunately, this is flawed by brisk bleeding. The vessels responsible for this is most likely to here options are portal vein, phrenic vein, right adrenal vein, superior mesenteric vein, inferior vena cava. So here uh, if we see we can see uh, you are assisting in open right adrenal tube for large large adrenal adenoma that means it occupies a large area uh, pull the adrenal gland you pull the adrenal gland in the e wound to improve the view here the pulling of the adrenal gland that will responsible for tearing of the vessel so uh, any uh, vessel it is possible uh, to be tear uh, if the vessel lies close to the adrenal gland so we have to find out uh, the vessels which lies very close to the adrenal gland especially right adrenal gland because here right adrenectomy during a right adrenectomy uh, the bleeding occurs so we have to find out um, the important blood vessels which lies very close to the right adrenal gland so let's see in the question here uh, it is the right adrenal gland or right suprarenal gland and here you can see a left suprarenal gland the right suprarenal gland it lies just above the right kidney and here, here we can see there is different vessels such as uh, this is uh, inferior uh, phrenic vessel and inferior phrenic vessel it is superior suprarenal artery and other arteries including here we can see the inferior vena cava this is inferior vena cava inferior vena cava is very very close it is very close to the right adrenal gland so in case of traction of the right adrenal gland uh, it is possible to tearing the inferior vena cava so uh, in this picture we can see some other vessels are very close to the adrenal gland such as uh, superior suprarenal gland, middle suprarenal gland, and inferior suprarenal. Uh, sorry, super, um, uh, superior suprarenal artery, middle suprarenal artery, inferior uh, suprarenal artery. But uh, they don't produce disc hemorrhage. They uh, cause hemorrhage, but uh, which is not a huge amount. So a huge amount of bleeding uh, occurs from a large vessel like this. This inferior vena cava. Here in the second picture, uh, we can see uh, this is the right suprarenal gland, this is right kidney and uh, the traction of the right suprarenal gland may cause injury to the this large inferior vena cava. Here we can see the uh, adrenectomy procedure, here we can see the diathermy. So traction uh, the, uh, of the suprarenal gland uh, may impair the vessels of the inferior vena cava so our final answer is inferior vena cava so during right adrenal gland removal it is possible to injury to the inferior vena cava